The shocking truth about prosperity is that you are in the driver's seat. You are in control of your destiny. You can be completely immune to outside events, polarizing elections, and economic surprises if you take full responsibility for your future and take action. Your success does not depend on what you start with or your current circumstances. Your success hinges on the vision you create for yourself. Total financial freedom is possible. You can make money without showing up for a job that robs you of your time. Instead, you can make memories with your family, take a vacation whenever you want, give back to your community, and live your dream life. You can do this by creating a business that works for you around the clock and can be run 100% from home. Now, more than ever, you have unprecedented opportunities to reinvent your life. It may not seem that way since our news feeds have been dominated by headlines of a global economic fallout, the tens of millions of people that were furloughed or permanently laid off, and crippling lockdowns. The story that's not getting covered is the protected class who came out ahead during the pandemic. This group didn't get special protections. Rather, they were in the right place at the right time. These are everyday people like you and me who discovered the world of e-commerce. Their livelihood skyrocketed while traditional retailers like JCPenney and Neiman Marcus filed for bankruptcy. That's because the story you didn't hear in the news is the 21.6 trillion in global retail sales that are coming online fast and online business owners are getting rich. Today, you have a once in a lifetime opportunity to build real wealth during the greatest wealth transfer of the past 20 years. We wanna show you how to profit from this massive change so you'll never be dependent on a faceless corporation again for your financial livelihood. You deserve to have the freedom to do what you want, when you want, wherever you want. The day of the nine to five is gone. Stop hoping for a good time to ask your boss for a raise. Stop waiting for politicians to prioritize your financial well-being. You are in the driver's seat of your life and your prosperity. You need a source of income that you control that works for you no matter what you're doing with your time. You want a source of income that doesn't depend on location so you can make money from home or on the road if you love to travel. It's time to create a sustainable income stream that will consistently grow year after year. Today, with the reach of the internet, this is easier than ever before. The best way to accomplish it is by building your own business online following a very specific model that we've developed. In this video series, we'll show you how to quickly start and grow your own business selling a brand you completely own. You don't need any business or e-commerce experience to be successful. All you need is desire to make a big change in your life today. Over the past eight years, we've helped over 35,000 people discover the path to financial freedom. We hate seeing people trapped, living unfulfilling lives with no way out because we used to be in the same situation. Years ago, I worked at an investment bank right at the beginning of the 2008 financial crisis. The economy was crumbling, but worst of all for me, I was miserable at my soul-sucking 16-hour-a-day job, so I quit. I found my way into e-commerce by chance. It wasn't easy at the beginning. I made tons of mistakes, and at one point early on, I was even $100,000 in debt, but I kept learning and eventually figured out how to build a profitable, cash-producing online business. Once I learned the real secrets to success in e-commerce, I built multiple businesses with a total of over $200 million in sales online. Today, with the same method we're showing you in this video series, one of my brands generates as much as $2 million every single month. Like Matt, I worked in the corporate world. For 20 years, I was a good employee. As finance director for a telecommunications company, I'd wake up each day, go into the office, and do the work I was supposed to do. But secretly, I was looking for a way out. I didn't want to wait another 20 years to retire. With my corporate job, I felt like I was missing out on watching my daughter and son grow up. I wanted to control my schedule and work from home. I wanted to spend time with my family, go on vacations, and live the life I wanted now. So. I built my first business with the model you're learning today, and within a year, I was producing enough income from my business to quit my job. Since then, I've sold multiple millions per year with brands even selling as much as $250,000 in a single day. For the past nine years, I've been on a mission to help people achieve financial freedom and avoid all the painful lessons I had to learn on my own. I know there's a better, easier, faster way to build a cash-producing business that you own online. Mike was one of my very early students. He's living proof complete financial freedom is possible. Plus, 
Not only is Mike the owner of a multi-million dollar e-commerce business, he's also now one of the top experts at the specific model you're about to learn. We estimate the people we've taught have sold over $9 billion through their own businesses. They've come from all different backgrounds and levels of experience. Take Leah and David Cups, for example. Leah was a graphic designer and David was in medical sales. They started with no online experience and quickly built and sold their first business within a few years for $4 million. They've since built multiple new businesses from scratch with the same exact steps you're learning here. Those businesses are now worth millions of dollars too. This is proof this model works. It works today and it's repeatable by anyone who follows the right steps. We've brought them here today so you can hear directly from them. All right, thanks David and Leah, thanks for joining us. Uh, so wanted to, before we get into you all's story, I wanna kind of briefly touch on something. So at this point, y'all have sold four different brands with three different exits and you know, there's a lot of privacy and, and restrictions around the details you can give on this kind of stuff with selling any kind of business, but it's been in the easy to say like multiple seven figures. Is that all correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay, cool. And then when did you start your first brand? 2014 towards the end of 2014. Okay. And then what were you doing before you started it? So David was working as a medical sales rep and I was working um, as a freelance graphic designer. And I was having a, a meeting with one of my clients. I was redoing some packaging for her uh, skincare line. And I asked her if she sold products on Amazon and she said, no, Amazon's really difficult. So I haven't tried to sell my products there. I went home and I Googled how to sell products on Amazon and I stumbled across a video of Matt and uh, Jason uh, talking about how to do that. And that's how we got started. You know, so that kind of talks about how you got started, but why did you make that decision to get started? Was there something you wanted to get out of the business? So at the time I was working in medical sales and I was, uh, um, you know, I got my dream job and, and the problem was, is might've been my dream job revenue wise, but we had a daughter and um, found myself being gone like four nights a week uh, from in medical sales, just traveling. <clears throat> and so the, uh, I would get home and it was like, my daughter didn't, our daughter didn't recognize me. You know, it was like, she, she would let me hold her or whatever. I was like, man, I was like this, I can't just be this absent dad that, you know, yes, we're making more money, but um, you know, it's not how I want to raise a family. And so we started looking at ideas of, of how we can, uh, be together, like be home together as a family. And we called it the Bring Daddy Home Project. And how long was it before you were able to bring daddy home? It was two uh, years. 2016. Yeah, we have a so, picture of us all out to dinner at David's retirement party. <laughs> when he retired from um, medical sales and traveling. I really appreciate you all joining us here. You all are an awesome example. You are so giving. You keep telling people your story and message while you're super busy, you know, raising your family and building your businesses. So yeah, I really appreciate you all doing this. Oh, thank yeah, you. Thanks guys. Well, we appreciate you. We appreciate everything that you've done for people. Now that you know the huge opportunity and you've even heard from people, including Mike and Leah and David, who've succeeded with it, what do you do first? If you could have someone do 90% of the work for you getting started, would that make it easier to be successful? If you could leverage billions of dollars in resources and infrastructure for pennies, would that give you a huge advantage in getting off the ground? Now what if you could build an entire e-commerce brand you own without a warehouse, without employees, and even without a website? Wouldn't that make it so much easier? Well, you can. Since 1994, before the internet reinvented the modern world, there's been a company on a mission to revolutionize shopping online. They started with books, then built a business online that sells everything from toilet paper to beauty creams to dresses to even pre-built houses now. This company is Amazon. They've grown from nothing to a nearly $2 trillion company. And Amazon continues to grow at a rapid pace because of the unstoppable growth of online shopping. Now, we don't work for Amazon, though we have done some work together. We have zero financial incentive to tell you about this massive business. However, they've created the easiest, fastest, lowest cost way for you to start your own e-commerce business today. I started selling on Amazon in 2010. The opportunity and sales volume is now 13 times bigger than back then. Amazon will handle your warehousing, your shipping, most of your customer service, website hosting, fraud prevention, returns, and a heck of a lot more. Compared to the cost of putting this all together yourself, it's very cheap. Plus, because we've been doing this so long and are constantly at the cutting edge of what's working to make sales on Amazon, 
we've developed special strategies specifically for Amazon to make consistent sales fast, even with a brand new product. The brand you build is yours. You can and should sell it everywhere you can. Ultimately, this means on your own website and maybe even in retail stores. But starting with Amazon allows you to start making money as quickly as possible with a very little startup cost. The first step is to pick a product to sell. I'm about to show you how to use Amazon to find a hot product opportunity to start your business. Some products you'll find using these steps have the potential to generate 1 million or more in sales per year. You'll learn the four criteria that make a perfect product opportunity, where to find those products, how to find suppliers, and when to make the decision to place your first inventory order. So what Mike's about to show you is incredibly important for your business because your first product is gonna serve as the foundation for your business. In general, he's gonna walk you through the four criteria, but in general, what you're looking for are products with high sales volume and low competition. And one other critical thing, you want products that you can actually private label. So this product right here, the only thing that separates this from somebody else's product is a tiny little brand name right here. So Mike's gonna show you how to find products just like these you can sell on Amazon. To check out the profit potential and competition, we start by going to Amazon. Amazon already tells us which products are selling the best through their best seller section right here. When we go there, we can see the top selling products on all of Amazon in the top level categories, such as automotive, baby, beauty and personal care, cell phones and accessories, and over 30 other categories. Now we're gonna use these categories, start drilling down into more specific products that we can sell ourselves on Amazon. Each of these top level categories has hundreds of subcategories within them. And by going deeper into them, we're gonna find hidden product opportunities that are both profitable and easy to launch. The only categories that we want to ignore are those that include books, movies, and video games, because what we're looking for are physical products that we can build an entire brand around. So how do you decide which categories to start looking in? One easy way is to simply think about your own personal hobbies and interests. If you like to cook, start in kitchen and dining. If you're into all things baby related, then start in baby. Every category will have good opportunities. So it's best to start your search in those categories that are of interest to you. Now, since Matt and I have had to do a lot of video recording at home lately, I'm gonna show you how we found the selfie ring light that he showed you earlier. So we're gonna go into the cell phone and accessories categories. Then I'm going to drill down into accessories. Then I'm going to go down and look for something that has video and photo accessories. And finally, I'm gonna find the mobile flashies and selfie lights category. Once I'm in the subcategory with products that I'm interested in, like this one right here, I'm gonna use a little trick to pull up not only the top selling products, but also the most search for products. Now we do this by typing in the exact same subcategory name into the search. So in this case, it's going to be mobile flashes and selfie lights. When we do this, Amazon's going to return the best selling products that customers are buying when they do that search. Now, another benefit of putting in that search term is it allows us to use a special tool called MBS Retriever. MBS Retriever, or just Retriever for short, it's a special tool that uses real Amazon data to show you exactly how much money each of these profits are generating each month. We've included instructions for getting access to this tool for free in the bonus download beneath this video. Now, when you use Retriever on the search results for any search page on Amazon, it's gonna give you critical information that you need for finding great opportunities. You can see the price, the number of monthly sales, the amount of revenue each product is generating, and a whole lot more. Now, what we wanna do is use a filter feature as well to narrow down our list and make sure that there's plenty of profit to be made, yet still plenty of room for competition. We do that by enabling filters. I'm going to put in a maximum price of $100, and the reason we do that is we know that if you sell products that are that expensive, then your initial inventory cost is gonna be way more than it has to be for your first product. Next, we're also gonna put in a minimum monthly revenue of 40,000. We do this because a product generating that many sales at an average profit margin of 25%, which is the minimum number we look for for profit, it indicates a product that's generating not only $480,000 per year in sales, but also $10,000 a month in profit. And in a few minutes, I'll show you exactly how to calculate the potential profit for any product on Amazon. Now, we can see here that there are multiple sellers selling this type of product. The top seller is selling well over $636,000 per month, making this a $7 million product per year. 
and there are still multiple other sellers making anywhere from $40,000 to $290,000 per month in sales for these products. If you apply these filters and have at least three products that are still there, then that's a good indication that there's plenty of room for competition with this type of product. There's not one single product dominating every single sale, and there are multiple products generating a half million dollars or more every year in sales. Now, if you saw less than three products remaining, you'd simply go search in another of the tens of thousands of subcategories on Amazon. But as you can see here, the Selfie Light Ring not only has great sales and profit potential, but it also has plenty of room for a new seller just like you to jump right into. Now, once you've found a good product opportunity like this, the next step is to find a supplier and validate its profit potential. So where and how do we do that? Well, unless your product goes on your skin or in your body, we use a site called Alibaba.com. That's where you can find suppliers for almost every product sold on Amazon. I'm gonna start off by searching for this product on Alibaba. So selfie ring light. Now when we do that, we're gonna get back a ton of results. As you can see here, 17,654 results. Uh, that's a lot of products to search through. What we can do is also start filtering things down. One of the filters that I like to use is make sure that the maximum price that I'm looking and willing to pay is one third of the selling price of the product that we're looking at on Amazon. So if we go back to Amazon and we pull up this top selling selfie ring, we can see that it's selling for $34.99. So that means the maximum that I'm willing to pay for that product to be made would be one third of that, or somewhere around 11 or $12. So if we go back into Alibaba, I'm gonna make the maximum price be $11 and hit okay. Now, once we do that, it's gonna show me all types of products that are not only the type of product I wanna sell, it's also gonna make sure that I can get at least a 25% or more profit margin on this product. Now, once we find one that looks similar to the product that we're selling, you simply click on it, you can make sure that uh, by looking at the pictures and the video that this is something that's very similar to the one that we're looking for. And then you can check out the prices as well to make sure that we're well within the price we're willing to pay. And remember, I was willing to pay up to $11 for this product. Well, you can see that you can get products for as little as $6.89, but even ordering the lowest quantity, you can still only pay $8.55, which already tells me that I'm going to have a good profit margin off of this product. Now, the way that I really can determine that is I'm going to use a tool called the Amazon FBA Revenue Calculator Tool. You can find this by doing a simple Google search for Amazon FBA Revenue Calculator Tool. Now, the first thing you want to do is put in the ASIN or unique product keyword for the product that we're looking for. If I go back and see the selfie ring, you can see the ASIN right there in the product URL. We're going to copy that, paste that into the Revenue Calculator, and hit search. Now, if it pulls up multiple results, just click on the one that looks mostly like the product that we're looking for, and that's this one right here. We're gonna put in the price that we wanna sell it for. In this case, it's gonna be $34.99. Then we're going to include the price that it's going to cost us to pay for this. And if we go back over to Alibaba, we know that even ordering the lowest quantity, it's gonna be $8.55. We're gonna put that in right here. And we know that's gonna cost something to ship this product over from China to Amazon's warehouse. So I'm also gonna put in an additional dollar in cost for this product. Then we click on calculate. And as you can see here, this product using even the higher numbers that we found before we start getting discounts and ordering more generates over a 34% in profit margin. And that's $12 on each and every sale that you make on Amazon. This is exactly the type of profit that we like to look for. Now, the next thing we want to do is we actually want to order product samples because the only way to ensure that you have a good quality product that customers are going to love, going to give you good reviews for, is to make sure that you check out the samples and order them from one of the suppliers that you find on Alibaba. And ordering a sample can be pretty simple. You could contact a supplier by clicking on this little email icon and send them an email, but some of the suppliers on here, if you don't want to talk to them right now, they make it even simpler. If you click on the Buy Samples button, it's going to walk you through the process of ordering a sample online. As you can see here, I could go ahead and order a sample for $20 and have it shipped here for 25 extra, meaning that I can get an entire sample to start a new product, new business with for less than $46. That's how easy it can be to order a product sample from Alibaba. And again, it's an important step because we wanna check out the sample and make sure the quality is as good or better than the product we're looking at on Amazon. So that's how you find a product using Alibaba. Now, what do you do when you're looking for a product that goes either on your skin or in your body, such as beauty creams or supplements? 
Well, that's when we head on over to Google and do a simple Google search. All we need to do is type in the type of product we're looking for and then put the words private label either before or after it. So let's imagine we're looking for men's eye cream. We type in men's eye cream and then put the word private label right after it. And then as you can see here, we are going to see hundreds of thousands. In this case, it's showing us 310 million results. Now, there aren't that many private label sellers for this product, but the point is there are thousands of people looking to sell you and I products in order to private label our products for us. All we do is scroll down. We can see that there are lots of companies out there selling eye cream for dark circles for men, private label, uh, private label skincare products, cucumber eye cream. Uh, what you'd want to do is simply click on these links check out the different providers and sellers for this, contact them just like we do in Alibaba, and even get a quote and sample from them. That's how easy it is to find products that go either on your skin or in your body. Now, the final step is actually choosing which product you're going to sell. And we make that decision based upon profit, quality, and supplier communication. You want at least a 25% profit margin. You want a high quality product that you can test and tell from the samples that you get. And choosing a supplier that's responsive to your questions and able to work with you easily, it'll go a long way down the road when you're scaling your business and looking to find even more products to grow your brand with. Now with what you just learned, you now know how to find the perfect product opportunity using the four criteria we use each time we look for our own new products. Good profit potential, plenty of room for competition, a good high quality product, and the ability to private label it. As Mike mentioned, the last criteria is you want the ability to private label the products that you find. This is incredibly important because you want to own the brand, but it's super simple. So take, for example, this product right here, which is a selfie light. The only thing that makes this product somebody else's brand is a tiny little logo right here. And you can't see this, but there's also the same thing right here on the back. That's it. They have that, and then they have a logo on their packaging. You could have a product just like this, almost identical, using the exact steps that Mike showed you, but with your brand and your logo on there. Same thing applies to this product. This is a moisturizing eye cream. It has a sticker on here with somebody's logo and a sticker around here with somebody's logo. Otherwise, this is a generic product and generic packaging. That's how easy it is to create your own brand. So this is absolutely the route you wanna go because your profit margins will be way higher, your business will be worth more, and you'll have a heck of a lot more control over your business. Follow the steps we just showed you to find great product opportunities on Amazon with high sales volume and low competition. Sarah Tedesco worked at a local organic farm, managing their farmer's market stand before starting this business. She followed these steps, found her first product opportunity, and ordered her batch of inventory with her branding on it. In her first six days of selling, she sold over $1,000 of her product. Within the first 19 days, she profitably sold $25,000 of it. Her family and friends are blown away by how fast her business has grown. Now, it's your turn. Use this information to find your own product opportunity today and change your life forever. To help you find your product even faster, Download our curated list of 100 hot product opportunities for free. Every one of them has been estimated to generate $1 million in sales per year. This list is only available for a limited time. So click the button below to access your free list and pick your perfect opportunity. The opportunity today to start an e-commerce business from scratch following this model is bigger than anything I've ever seen in over a decade in e-commerce. Recent events have created a huge increase in demand for products online. There are thousands of opportunities available for people following the right steps to profit quickly. But like all good things, this window of opportunity won't be available for long. The faster you pick a product and take action, the easier it will be for you to succeed. So don't wait. Download the list below, rewatch this video if necessary, and get started looking for your first product to sell. Today, you learned how to find great product opportunities using Amazon and how to find reputable suppliers for your first product. In the next video, you'll learn how to easily add your new product to Amazon. You'll discover how small, powerful tweaks to your product page on Amazon can result in nearly instant sales, even if nobody has ever heard of your brand before. All this and much more is coming up in the next video. We'll see you there.